and drop. Drip, drop top, drop top. Smoking on cooking the hot box. Cooking, fucking on your bitch, yeah, that, that, that. What's going on guys, it's your boy Crimson here and welcome back to another video. Now, I should have covered this story two weeks ago, okay? Because when this story first broke out, the story immediately blew up because of how stupid it was. This for me is one of the dumbest stories I have ever heard because of how ridiculous it is. Like honestly, I cannot believe how entitled some people are these days. This blew up on Twitter, everybody was talking about this story. I cannot believe that I've only just come across this story now, but I'm covering the story right now. So without further ado, let's get right down to today's video. Now, this story is about Dr. Dre and his wife, Nicole Young. Now, as you know, Dr. Dre is a rapper, one of the best rappers of all time, I guess you could say. This alone, you think, hmm, it shouldn't really be trending at first, but we'll get right down to it. But anyway, this is a story concerning their marriage. Now, Dr. Dre and his wife, Nicole Young, have announced that they are getting a divorce. That alone would be enough to kind of get a lot of people talking on Twitter because obviously it's Dr. Dre. I mean, who doesn't talk about Dr. Dre? However, it doesn't stop there. I mean, this goes a lot deeper than that because like I said, it's one of the dumbest stories I've ever heard. It gets worse, wait for it. So it says here, according to TMZ, Dr. Dre, a strange wife justifies $2 million monthly support claims domestic violence. Bitch, first of all, you were the one that initiated the divorce. So how the hell can you turn around and demand two million dollars a month to cover your lifestyle and second of all what's the point in doing this because when it comes to the divorce courts obviously they're biased i'm just gonna say it right now they're biased she's gonna get half of his shit so what is really the point but anyway the article goes on and it says dr dre's estranged wife claims in legal documents dre was violent with her in the past and she also ticked off why she needs nearly two million dollars a month in temporary spousal support while their divorce winds its way through the legal system and it's expenses she lists are eye popping. Nicole Young wants $1,936,000 $399 to cover her expenses. What? To cover her lifestyle? She's now demanding nearly $2 million to support her lifestyle. Who the hell does she think she is? This is why men don't get married anymore. It's people like this who contribute absolutely nothing to the marriage that are the reason why men don't get married anymore. But that's not the worst part. Oh no. No, 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 no. This is not the worst part. See, here's the breakdown of her expenses. Now this is the worst part. Get ready. You're going to laugh because when I first saw this story and when I first saw these demands I was dying of laughter I was dying of laughter because this here sums up the level of entitlement people have these days I mean it's honestly ridiculous how somebody can be this entitled but anyway let's start off with the first one laundry and cleaning $10,000 a month 10k a month what kind of soap is she using stardust like who spends 10k a month on laundry and cleaning now look I understand with rich people okay they're gonna pay maids or whoever to to do some chores around the house but 10k a month how are you spending 10k a month it still doesn't come to 10k you know what? i'll be honest okay per month i would say i don't know two thousand dollars a month hiring a maid to do the chores around the house so why the hell is she demanding 10k a month where is that number coming from oh but it gets worse like i always say it gets worse but trust me this actually gets worse the next one clothes a hundred and thirty five thousand dollars a month what the f two hours later what in the hell is that? Where does she shop at? Rodeo Drive or Fifth Avenue? Who spends 135k a month on clothes? Look, listen, listen. If I was a millionaire, even I would not spend 135k on clothes every month. That is beyond a joke. 135k. Like, listen, listen. You could buy all the clothes in the world. That wardrobe will get full eventually. Like, who the hell does she think she is? Like, you think you can make these crazy demands and think that this is somehow okay? She actually thinks that this is somehow okay or reasonable where is the justification in demanding 135k a month on clothes i'm speechless i'm speechless i don't even know what to say I, you know what let's just get to the next one education tuition and living expenses 60 grand a month oh is this is this bitch serious okay all right all right let me give you some context all right the most expensive university in america is the university of chicago according to cbs news now per year this is per year Year, by the way it costs $81,531 per year she's demanding 60 grand a month when the most expensive university in America is $81,531 where does 
does she get these numbers from? Like, is she stupid? Like, does she actually not know how much universities cost? One cannot be this stupid. Oh, but it gets worse. You know, I'm just, I'm just going to keep saying it gets worse. But this next one is the one that everybody's talking about. This is the one that made this entire story go viral. Because this is the dumbest one on the list by a mile. Like, it's not even close. Entertainment. Get ready for this. She's demanding $900,000 a month. You know what? Nah. No, no, no. I'm walking. I'm, I'm gone. I'm gone. I can't be bothered. What is even the point? A few moments later. Who in the rotted does she think she is? 900k a month on entertainment. Alright, let this sink in, alright? Her clothes, 135k a month. She wants nearly nine times that amount just for entertainment. What kind of entertainment is she getting every month? What, some sort of intergalactic entertainment? Oh, or even better, is she hiring the cast of Fast and Furious? Or Pirates of the Caribbean? Or Avengers? Or Star Wars? Oh wait, no, even better. How about this? She's probably hiring rappers such as Drake, Future, Eminem, Kendrick Lamar, J. Cole. What business does she have demanding 900k a month on entertainment? She actually lives on Cloud9. You know what it is with these type of people? They're so entitled but yet so privileged. Like the only reason you're even relevant and the only reason people know who you are is because you're the wife of Dr. Dre. That's it. That's all you are known for. You did absolutely nothing to deserve the lifestyle you have. The fact that you have the audacity to demand 900k a month on entertainment that is the most infuriating one on the list if i actually maybe not maybe not this one for me personally is the most infuriating one on this entire list you'll figure out why just get ready charitable contributions she wants a hundred and twenty five thousand dollars a month hold up a minute who the hell do you think you are you're going to demand 125k of somebody else's money to then donate it to charity and then pass it off as if it came out of your pocket that's the worst one on this entire list for me personally Personally. Again, who the hell does she think she is? Yo, I could rant about this story all day long because it actually pisses me off. Like I said, this is why men don't get married anymore. On to the next demand. Mortgage. $100,000 a month. Hold up a minute. Is this the dumbest bitch in the world? Let me get this straight. She wants nearly a million dollars a month on entertainment and she wants 100 k a month for her mortgage. Is she actually stupid? Who the hell spends nine times the money on entertainment? Entertainment than your own mortgage. Like, I don't think this is actually real. This can't be real. This can't be real. I sense I'm being trolled here. Let me get this straight. So, all the necessities that you'd have in your house, such as food, water, clothing, a bed, she wants to spend nine times the money on entertainment. She thinks entertainment is more important than her mortgage and that it's more important than sustaining a healthy lifestyle. You can't be this stupid. I am lost for words. I cannot believe this story is even real. It's people like this that put me off getting married listen when i hear stories like this i ask myself do i really want to get married because i know there are people like this out there who are nothing more than gold digging parasites they don't love you for who you are they love you for what you have in your bank account they just use you that's it they don't care about you truly and it's people like this that piss me off you know i'm done with this story already but there's one more to go this might be probably the dumbest one the last demand that she has on this list is arguably the dumbest demand on this entire list now i thought entertainment was the dumbest one i thought charitable donations was the worst one but this one honestly this confirms to me just how stupid this individual actually is like this just confirms to me how dumb she is because it makes no sense whatsoever so the last one goes like this telephone cell phone email 20k a month oh my god I can't do this anymore. No, no. Again, who in the rotted does she think she is? First of all, email is free. It's free. Email is free. She actually thinks you have to pay to send an email. A grown woman thinks that you have to pay to send an email. Listen, listen. I don't even know what to say. I'm speechless, okay? Also, telephone, cell phone, 20k a month. What, is, what kind of phone does she have? A gold iPhone or a gold Samsung with what, 10G or something? What 
what kind of phone does she have that she needs to spend 20k a month on it listen listen i can assure you of this there is not one phone out there where you have to pay 20k a month on a contract there is not a single phone on this planet that causes you to pay 20k on it per month another thing on laundry and cleaning i forgot to say this how can a grown woman not do her own laundry listen i was taught to do my laundry at about 16 and yet a grown woman can't even do that by herself why should someone have to wash up your dirty laundry and finally it says here as we reported the court is also asking for five million dollars to cover her attorney's fees yo Yo, I'm actually speechless. I don't even know what to say. Like, not only does she have some of the most ridiculous demands I've ever heard from any wife, not even any individual, actually, but she now has the audacity to demand that he also pay for her attorney's fees. Also, again, who spends $5 million on attorney fees? I don't know what it's like in America, but I am 99.9% .9 sure that you do not spend $5 million on attorney's fees. I could be wrong, but I am 99.9% .9 sure. This bitch actually has the nerve like not only has she just embarrassed herself on social media she's just demonstrated exactly why men don't get married anymore because she's just a parasite she's a leech in the words of train wrecks okay this woman is the peak definition of shameless the peak definition of shameless like she actually thinks this is normal she actually thinks that this is reasonable that like, she sees absolutely nothing wrong with that i'm actually done with this story i can't be bothered with this anymore man i actually i'm actually got a headache i've actually got a headache because one cannot be this stupid but anyway it's been your boy crimson and i'll see you in the next video